Hi everybody, Kate Freeman here with another Lester story. I think today is number eight. So if you haven't seen them all, check it out. Uh, we're posting some of them on YouTube, so you can look there too. So, um, today I wanted to tell you a little story that Lester told me. And um, it was always kind of dear to me. You know, Lester attained his freedom very quickly. He hadn't had a lot of spiritual training or anything. So he, um, he, he, everything was new. He didn't even know how to talk about his freedom in a way that people could understand. It took him a while. So he was still eating beef and pork and all the things that he used to eat. And he said one day, and the way he said it was, the cow came and took him by the hand. And what he, I asked him about it later, and he said he meant that um, it didn't really take him by the hand but it it took him internally it took him not physically but it took him and showed him where they butchered the cows and what happened to them and so he saw the trauma and the pain and the agony that they went through the fear and he realized that he didn't want to eat beef anymore. And so he, he was vegetarian when I knew him. And so I became vegetarian um, for a long, long, long time. And one day, Lester came in. I had been to visit my family and at that time, my father just loved to fish. He really loved to fish. So he would bring home fish, especially when they had company or one of the kids was home. So I was there. So he brought this fish in that he had caught, a great big uh, salmon out of the river, and I refused to eat it. Well, I think Lester knew this. I mean, he must have. Because he said, he said, you know, I'm vegetarian, but sometimes it really bothers people if I don't eat something when we go out to dinner. So he said, if I see it's going to bother them, then I have a little piece of fish. And Later, I realized he was doing that so I didn't hurt my father. And so I would eat a little piece of fish, and Dad was so happy. <laughs> so that's how Lester became a vegetarian. And he said, if you really want to grow quickly, you have to consider what you're putting in your body and how that energy that you're putting in your body affects you. So that, um, that's how he became a vegetarian. So tomorrow I'm going to talk about tendencies, um, Lester and the programs. So I'll see you tomorrow, same time. Lots of love. Thanks for coming. Heartofreleasing.org is the website. Lots of love. Bye.